Hi everybody, it's Sally with Vintage Discoveries here with some more vintage jewelry haul and unbagging and a few other things. Picked up some really uh, different cool items. Oh, I don't know what to show first. I'll show this. It has to have an intro. Like, da, 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 da. like the US Enterprise. Oh. These are like Partridge Family nails. I don't think that's what it's labeled, but that's what I'm getting. Partridge Family bus, right? But anyway, this is a ring on my finger. Uh, London blue topaz, turquoise, 18 karat overlay in sterling. And it's a Michael Valentui, V-A-L-I-T-U-T-T-I. Also, I think they're uh, called Gems by Michael, something like that. So, I'm just really attracted to these little things there. It's not picking up how amazingly beautiful the blue is. So, but these are cool. I like, I like it. I'm surprised how much I like it, but um, yeah. But if anybody wanted to purchase, um, since we're not having a an auction on Wednesday, uh, me and Carla, we're gonna skip a week. So things that I'm showing, I'll let you know the price. And if you wanna buy them, you can email me at vintage.discoveries21 at gmail.com and PayPal, of course. And um, just, you know, email me and let me know you want it and if you've never purchased before you can just tell me your paypal and if you're in the u.s because um i think i'm just gonna stick to the u.s with the sales for for right now um that's a little less stress on me um for this week but yeah let me know um this michael valentuti i could do for 185 plus shipping and shipping is going to run depending on where you are four or five dollars so so 185 for that and you probably not want to know what the size is and i'll let you know in a minute <laughs> i have to get up and get my little sizer so there's that then we have this this is freshwater pearls sterling it's got the toggle and this sunflower with the mother of pearl and it's sterling and you can see the label there or the hallmark uh, it's also got the hallmark here with a 925 because they do sell these separately in the necklace necklaces separately sometimes and you can interchange them, but this this is on here. This is not interchangeable, but interchangeable. But um, the company is Waxing Poetic. Not sure if anyone is um, familiar with that. They uh, they make some really nice stuff. So if anybody's interested in this, um, you can just let me know, and it would be uh, one twenty five. And you can research it and look at their website and see it's a good deal because just the, this part they were going for a uh, hundred and two just for the yeah believe it or not but yeah everything for 125 I like it I just discovered them and then have these I have two of them. These are J. King turquoise and sterling necklaces. This one has a lot of a lot of brown. I don't know uh, if what's what the name of the turquoise would be, but um, I know this one has a lot of brown inclusions. This one not as much. It's more um, on the green side or the blue, I should say but beautiful graduated turquoise beads. 
love. Really pretty. And these I'm going to do for 75 each. And I still have the, the sage in. This is going to be, um, I wrote it down, I did. I'm going to do 180, 180 for this, so big sage in. And what's next? Oh, speaking of sagin, this carved bone with the abalone, heavy, heavy sterling silver. It's a pin pendant. It's got the, the label right there. This one is huge, really big. Beautiful statement piece, really. And this one I would do for 200. It's, it's kind of magical. It's got like a feather design here. Really cool and very heavy. Then we have this Austrian this is old glass bracelet. The glass on here is just, the color is unbelievable. Beautiful blue. I think it's brass. That's the end there. Yep, really, really pretty. Almost look like birds. I just, the glass is beautiful. It's probably Austrian, but yeah, this one I think I'm gonna hold on for a few few minutes I haven't I haven't worn it yet or anything it's beautiful um, this is glass and it's short it's like 14 inches but it's uh, Sandor is the brand I love their stuff uh, Sandor, uh, I think they started in 1939, I believe, or the 1920s. I know that in 1939, they went from Sandor to Sandor uh, Goldberger. Oh, yeah, in 1940. And um, it was a small operation. Supposedly, they only had like 60 employees, and every design came from um, Sandor Goldberger and his wife, Jane. Jane, his wife. This is quite weighty. It's in perfect condition, and it's 14 inches. And I haven't quite researched it enough to figure a price, because it's... It's going to be something. Am I forgetting anything? No, I think that was it. Oh, beautiful stuff. Now I feel weird doing it unbagging because uh, that stuff is so beautiful. <laughs> but I'm going to do it anyway. This might not be anything that anybody else wants. But this is cute. Germany or Burmany. Mother of Pearl, little sweater clip. That's pretty. I take it back. There's some nice stuff. No idea what this stuff is.
seeing any name on it. I think I've had something like that before. A little silver chain. Not sterling though, but that'll come in handy. A quartz watch with, looks like full pearls. This is cute. More modern, I think. LR. Cute. Uh oh, I have a runaway pearl. Stretchy bracelet. Sometimes they're marked on the inside. And sometimes they're not. Kind of X's and O's, right? Oh, that's big. Oops. Mm, I can't read it. Alley? It's really not easy to see. It's a nice band. Let's see. That looks I thought it was like Texaco or something. What is that? CCCP. Huh. I'll have to look that up. It has a nice band. Another one of these. A heart. Something broken. Alex and Ani. Mickey. What year was that from? 2013. This is broken stuff. A little earring. I don't know what that is. Just some enamel or something? Oh my god. Goodness, these bags. Throw that out. Oh, Swarovski. Do I have another? Yeah. That's nice. This is chunky plastic beads. Heavy. Looks kind of like something Avon would have with, um, you know, different birthstones and things. This is just pieces and. Oh, I forgot to show you something. This is a custom custom made uh, sterling cuff it's marked uh, in here it's like an artist and artisan made item it's marked there what that means I don't know but it has the shell cameo with these sort of rainbow pearls in it kind of hammered free form that's hefty like really hefty uh, this if someone would like to purchase it it would be 225 and six it's a, fits about a six and a half inch wrist that is a showstopper definitely Let's go through this bag. Let's see if we can find something. Oh, I think I had these before. Trafari. These are pretty. I might have had them in silver tone. I don't know if the other one is here, but. Oh, see, I love this, but I don't know if it can be cleaned up. Do you think? I love that. That. Oh, look. 
sister. Or, you know, a little lapel pin type thing. Oh. I think this is for a um, big diaper. No. It's um, for the kilt, right? The kilt pin. Oh, this is cute. I love these little things. Kind of stuff that I would hold on to when I was a kid. Okay, kind of plain, but what does it say? Acid test. All right. Is this something they would use as a like a practice or something? I wouldn't think that would be a jewelry name, like a maker. Not looking like that. This is chunky. If you could clean this up, it'd be cool. This. And something attached to it. Okay. Um, it's not bad. Oh, this is like a carved... I think it's broken, though. It's like carved or smooth kind of bone. That's a pretty chain. Oh, I don't know if that could be straightened without... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm trying to look for the clasp. Oh, here we go. Let's see what it says. No, oh, I doubt it's 14 karat. It feels good. You can always test that. It does feel nice. It looks nice. Mmm. Interesting. I guess we'll put that to the side. Here's another one of the earrings. Yeah, I have to find my tester because I kind of feel silly if I take stuff to the pawn shop or something and like. No, that's not gold. But you never know. You just never know. But what's the chances, you know? It does look pretty good, though. But I don't know how they would overlook that, you know? I don't think she just throws stuff in a bag like that. Joan Rivers, classic. Jones of New York, J-N-Y. I just bought a really pretty blouse uh, from the thrift shop, and it was Jones of New York. Really pretty. Not normally my style, but I love the, it was like a pink coral color. One of these magnetic-y things everything sticks to. squished that copper right probably says that is copper no um what is that oh helps if you turn it around solid copper it's confirmed oh look at that that's pretty. Oh, Goldette, New York. Nice. It's got a nice feel to it. I like it. 
Oh, that makes nice stuff. What is that? Yeesh. That's a weird one, right? It's weirdly constructed. Bracelets. These. What's this? Oh, that's cute. Pretty. This, I think, is Avon. I think I have this. Is it? Yep. Yeah. Avon. It's broken. I think it's Trafari. No, it's Avon. <laughs> but it's broken. I don't like these chains. They're so stiff. What is this? Oh, one of these. And a bunch of little chains. Let's see if it's anything. No. Some of these super thin chains are gold filled or silver. I've seen some that are so fine. Oh my goodness. They're like... You wouldn't even know if they fell off your neck. Because they're so... So fine. Oh. But I do like the gold filled chains. And that's it on that bag. Well, thanks for joining me. I hope you enjoyed the video. And all the goodies. Let me know if anybody's interested in any of the items. Um, you know, like I said, just give me an email if you want specifics. I have to find out what size this ring is. I'm going to go with, with an eight and a half or something, but if you are interested, let me know. I'll definitely post it in the description in the video. Thanks for joining me. Um, I should have more soon. Um, don't forget to subscribe and like and thumbs up. And hopefully I will be back soon with some more stuff. Planning on going to Brimfield. I'm so excited about that in July. And I'm hoping to make some videos there. Because it's supposed to be amazing. So, looking forward to that. I will see you guys soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.